everybody, this is Leia and I really missed recording videos for you. It feels like a while since I recorded last week's daily readings and I've been so busy with other work and personal readings that it's like so much time has gone by. So for the week of August 11th through the 17th, our decks are the Housewives Tarot and the Oracle of the Mermaids. I've done a video review of the Oracle of the Mermaids, so if you like these cards, I'll post the link in the description box for you to look at. Our cards have been shuffled before filming with the intention that we receive helpful and uplifting messages. As we usually do, we are using one card per deck per day. So let's take a look at what Spirit has in store for us for the day. Hi, and welcome to our reading for August 12th, Tuesday. Our cards for the day are number 11 from the Major Arcana, Justice, and Sacrifice. There are those worth making, there are those that will destroy you. Our cards indicate that, in order for things to fall into place, either the way we've been dreaming of, or the way that's in the highest good of all, if there's nothing in particular that you've been wishing for. Sometimes we have to let go of something we've been doing or holding on to for a long time. This is because we need to make room for this change to happen. And that's what the sacrifice card is pointing to. In this particular instance, the sacrifice we're being called to make is for our own good. It's not one of those times where we feel like we're giving something up, but there's no payoff that we can really see. To give a clear example, if you want to write a book and you have a pretty full life, you may have to cut back on some activities like watching TV, or if you already don't watch a lot of TV, what can you put aside for now so you can accomplish your goal? And if it's an overall better life you want, then it's time to clean up the areas of your life where you've been slacking off or where you've gotten comfortable doing the same thing over and over, but it doesn't really serve you. You're stepping out of your comfort zone, which can be painful, but keep your eye on what you intend to manifest. This should help you stay inspired. Just remember that we do have a hand in the outcome of things, and that's a huge part of this message. Beyond the part where we're being guided to let go of a habit or part of our life in exchange for another. And that's just part of it. If you want to get something, sometimes you do have to let go of another thing. And it will turn out for your highest good. Thank you so much for joining me for this daily reading video. If you enjoyed it, please feel free to share it with anyone you know will benefit. I'll speak to you again soon. Namaste.